Today we're talking about VeChain and there's a lot to get excited about if you've been following this project. VeChain just hit some very impressive milestones with over 800,000 transfers of VOT3 and more than 1.5 million transfers of B3TR. These numbers are a huge deal and are really cementing VeChain's growing ecosystem. So let's dive in and unpack what is going on. All right. So let's get started with the basics. VeChain has been making waves in the crypto space for a while now, but these latest numbers really highlight just how fast their ecosystem is expanding. According to reports, there have been over 800,000 transfers of VOT3 and a whopping 1.5 million transfers of B3TR. These are tokens on the VeChain4 blockchain, and seeing this level of activity shows just how much momentum this project is building. So what are VOT3 and B3TR and why does this matter? Well, VOT3 is a governance token used to vote on key decisions within the VeChain ecosystem. Essentially, it gives holders a say in how the network is run, which is a big deal in the world of decentralized governance. On the other hand, B3TR is a token linked to a VeChain based project called VBetterDAO, one of VeChain's strongest projects. The fact that we're seeing such high transfer numbers of both these tokens means that people are actively using the VeChain platform, not just holding tokens. That's a key indicator of growth because it shows there's actual engagement in the network, not just speculative investment. As you might expect, the VeChain community is buzzing right now. If you've been on X or Reddit, you've probably seen a lot of excitement around these milestones. The VFAM, as they call themselves, are super bullish. And why wouldn't they be? This kind of activity is what you want to see if you're invested in a project long term. People are talking about how these milestones show that VeChain is more than just another blockchain project. It's actually being used in the real world applications, especially in the world of supply chain logistics sector. And let's be real, in the world of crypto, where so many projects are just hype and speculation, seeing actual use is a breath of fresh air. But of course, there's always some skeptics out there. Some folks are pointing out that while the numbers are impressive, it's still very early days. They're saying we need to see even more sustained growth and adoption for VeChain to truly break into the mainstream. And hey, that's a fair point. Blockchain projects can take time to mature. And while this is a big step, there's still a long road ahead. So what does this mean for VeChain's future? Well, if you're a VeChain holder or someone who's been following the project, these milestones are definitely a good sign. High token transfer activity usually means that the ecosystem is alive and well, with people participating in governance and real world use cases. VeChain has always been a, or has had a strong focus on enterprise level applications, particularly in supply chain management, and these numbers suggest that the platform is delivering on that vision. The growing uh, use of VOT3 and uh, for governance also signals that the community is, uh, is taking an active role in shaping the network, which is crucial for any decentralized projects to succeed. Looking ahead, if VeChain uh, can continue to attract more partnerships and keep growing its ecosystem, we could see even more impressive milestones. The project is already partnered with some pretty big names in the corporate world. As a blockchain adoption or as as blockchain adoption, VeChain is well positioned to be a major player in industries like logistics, healthcare, and even carbon tracking. VeChain is definitely making some big moves with over 800,000 transfers of VOT3 and 1.5 million transfers of B3TR. It's clear the ecosystem is growing and it's going to be an exciting, uh, so it's going to be very exciting to see where this project goes from here. What do you think? Is VeChain set to be a game changer or do you think? Uh, uh, or do you still think that it has a long way to go and a lot to prove? Drop your thoughts in the comments down below. We'd love to hear what you have to think. And click here for our latest video. You're not going to want to miss it.